Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to undervolt any Ryzen CPUs. So the first thing is to download AMD Ryzen Master Utility and Cinebench R20. You need both the softwares. The Ryzen Master app is to undervolt the CPU and the Cinebench R20 is to test the CPU temperature on full load. So download this both software. So after you have downloaded and installed the softwares, Open the Cinebench R20. So now open Ryzen Master app. So now click on run. So now the test has been begin. Now we can see the temperature over here. So now the temperature rise to 80 degrees. So now the temperature is 84 degrees. So the maximum temperature I got was 86. So now we can see the score over here. Not down this score. So we need this for the reference. Now on Ryzen Master, go to manual. Now increase the core clock uh, to the maximum speed. So in my processor, the maximum speed is 4100 4, MHz. So I am going to keep it 4100 MHz here. So if you have other CPUs, you will have different maximum frequencies. So I am going to keep 4.1. Now on voltage, keep it to 1.15 to 1.2 volts. So I am going to try 1.2. 2 volts you can keep anywhere between 1.15 to 1.2 volts so i'm going to use 1.2 volts click on apply now run the test again So as you can see the temperature is 76 degrees now. So the test has been finished. The maximum temperature I was getting like 75 to 76 degrees. So the in the previous test I was getting 86 degrees. So 10 degrees of reduction you see and the score also increased from previous which is a good sign. So you can reduce the temperature if you reduce the voltage. You can keep it from 1.15 to 1.2 volts. So don't go below 1.15. So if you have an high-end Ryzen CPUs or 5000 series processor, then you should not keep maximum frequency. You should keep it little less. Like in my case, I have the maximum speed of 4600 MHz, 4.6 kilohertz. So I should keep it to 4.3 or 4.4 gigahertz. So and the voltage should be 1.2 volts. After you have said that, click on apply and you can test it. So that's it. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, then give a like and subscribe.